at night we travel the levees, we travel the roads, and they're out hunting. So we're hunting the hunters. We have to be lucky though because, you know, we can drive by and then it can come, come up behind us. So it's just a matter of luck and also being in the right place at the right time. You jump out, you grab them with your hands. You basically have to grab them by the head and by the tail so that they don't wrap around you and get musk all over you. Right now we're in baby season. Last night I caught a, a little one who was 24 inches, but he has to go. Because if you think about it, that little guy uh, that's a few feet now will be four to six feet next year and six to 10 the following and be able to breed. You know, that's the reason why they're out there is because people got them as cute little guys within two, three years. They've outgrown their tank. You love the little thing. You want to let it go here, be free. And so that's why we have all these pythons out there. And unfortunately, they don't just stay at 10 feet. They get to be monsters. They have the food sources out there. Uh, they're eating alligators and deer and, you know, getting to be 18 feet long. Um, and that's what would happen if we left them out there. They'd all be able to get that big. Once they reach over, over 10 feet, um, there's not much to stop them. A big alligator, you know, could stop them. That and running them over with the car as long as you run over the head. 